Spectrum. Happy Saturday, folks. Another winter storm impacting the area, unfortunately, keeping any outdoor plans uh, in check for the most part. But we are going to see that rain and snow coming to an end by later this morning, leaving us with lots of clouds. But as we get that wraparound moisture, more uh, rain is expected for Sunday. And this is just the start of a pretty active pattern over the next seven days. Here's today's storm system as we take you out in time. It will quickly move away. High pressure should build in by the time we get to Monday, leaving us with a pretty nice day as we head back to work and school. But another storm developing quickly on its heels. It will bring us an all day soaking rain. It looks like for Tuesday with heavy snow on the back side of it. If you're in the Plain States, uh, you could get several rounds of heavy snow. Another break on Thursday with maybe some peaks of sunshine before by the time we get to next Friday, boom, here's another. A pretty strong st storm system moving through again right now. It looks like mostly a rain event with a heavy snow on the back side of that storm. So you're going to want to keep checking back with us for updates. But regardless, it looks like we're going to get some well needed moisture out of all of these storms. Weather Prediction Center saying at least two inches or more across a good part of the state. And you know what? Most of us need this precipitation because it has been very, very dry. A lot of us dealing with drought conditions. So we will take the moisture that we get in the short term as we look through the rest of today. Well, we do expect that mix of rain and snow to really wrap up by later this morning and then leaving us with mostly cloudy uh, conditions for a good part of the day. A uh, more local look at future cash shows that precipitation quickly getting out of here by uh, early afternoon for the most part. And we're just left with clouds, but then we get that wraparound moisture late tonight and into tomorrow morning, mainly in the form of showers. There could be a sleep pellet or two mixed in or a wet snowflake, but all of this should be non impactful for the most part. And Sunday's looking like a, another pretty dreary day with plenty of clouds around and hit or miss showers for the most part. In terms of accumulation, a slushy inch or two, mainly on grassy surfaces. Most of this should melt by this afternoon, but watch for a couple of slick spots if you're out this morning. Highs today stuck in the upper 30s. Lows tonight go almost nowhere, only falling by a handful of degrees for the most part. And then our highs tomorrow back up into the upper 30s. Quick look at the extended forecast really shows how active this pattern will be. But at least by Tuesday, we warm up to a